to my channel and today's video I'm doing this zombie nurse um, if you haven't already please subscribe to my channel and uh, you won't miss an upload and hit the like button if you want to go see how I did this then please keep watching I think it's that way <laughs> okay so let's get started um, I didn't get the footage of me putting on these little stickers but they're like peel off stickers that you can place a, a wet cloth over and put them on your face they didn't really last as well as I thought, but you know, you gotta work with what you got. And I'm using this cream face paint in this green shade and I'm going around my face. Now I didn't actually have a plan of what I wanted to look like, but I was like, I wanna be green. And then this is black face paint that I'm going around this kind of like wound on my face. It's supposed to look like two bones exposed, but it didn't really turn out well. And then I'm kind of like contouring the outside of my face with that. And I'm just using a foundation brush to put on the cream paint. You're probably better off using a sponge, but this is what I was working with. And it just, it took a while, but it worked. Then I'm just trying to apply it all down my neck and then I'm using this blue shade here and going into using that more as a contour. Why did I do this? I just wanted a deep contour type look but I didn't like love it. It kind of like took off the other shade so I just went around it as well. Now I'm using the Jaclyn Hill palette by Morphe and I'm using the shade Jade and I'm just actually I'm, I'm setting my eyes with this but I'm actually going to go over my entire face with a big fluffy brush and set my entire face with this. Now I'm just using this deeper green shade here and I'm going to put that in the crease of my eyes to kind of darken up the color, give myself a bit more dimension. And then I'm just using this black and a round flat top brush and kind of like carving out my eyes just to give myself a, again a bit more dimension instead of flat base green. I don't know exactly what I was going for, but I was just rolling with the punches. And then this is by Astralis Color Injected, and it is called Indie Rock, and it's like a black lipstick. And I'm just putting that on my lips. And then I use, and then I use a stippling brush to stamp around the edges of the wounds to make them look a little bit more realistic. Even though, yes, they don't look really realistic anyway, but still, I thought it looked cool. And I didn't have an idea of where I was going with this and I didn't think about my nurse costume until like very afterwards and I was like you know what I want to kind of be a zombie nurse so I actually when I was doing this had real no plan about it but I just went with the punches and I really liked how it turned out I'm using this black paint as well to fill in my eyebrows a bit more cartoony than I would normally do them just to make myself look a little bit less realistic. Again, do what you wanna do. If you wanna do like nice brows or whatever, you do you. And then this is the Astralis Contour and Highlight Kit and I'm using the deep shade to pat over my contour area that I did. I thought it looked cool. Now I'm using a sponge to kind of paint the rest of my body, more like my chest area and this actually took a while to get off so just be mindful I had to use a sugar scrub to get it off with my my body and then I'm using the stippling brush again with the fake paint uh, fake blood and going all over my body to give it a cool effect and I actually put it on my costume as well which made it look heaps awesome 
And then once that you've done that, because I'm not putting it on the parts that you can't see because I'll be covering it with my costume and my wig. Here is the Kali Bible uh, palette by B&H Cosmetics and I'm just highlighting my temple, my cheekbones quite, la like quite brightly because I want to be a glittery zombie. And that is it my loves. Thank you so much for watching. If you're new, please subscribe and hit that like button. All my social media links are down below. And yeah, subscribe right here, new video right here, and I'll talk to you in my next one. Bye.